Hey everybody, I'm Mike from Woodstock Furniture and Mattress Outlet. We're gonna talk today about mattress buying, specifically a King mattress, or maybe you might wanna go with the Split King. That's two twin XLs or extra longs, but then you're thinking, wait a minute, what about this crack? Is that a real issue? Will I fall in the middle of this crack? You watch this video to the end and we will deal with all of your potential concerns. All right, what are some of the concerns we have with a Split King mattress? Let's bring in our expert, Victoria. Good to see you as always. Hey. All right, <laughs> myth buster number one, that I'm gonna fall in the middle of that crack. Basically, it's the edge of the earth. Well, not really, <laughs> <No>. <laughs> not really. Um, in years past, sometimes adjustable bases could slide apart a little bit, but now they have, you know, something that kind of connects the two on the Split King. And then the mattresses have like an anti-skid fabric on the bottom of those. Sometimes the mattress will come, come apart a little bit, but will you fall through the crack? No, but your puppy might or an infant <laughs> might. Um, so that is a concern, but it's not really as large of a concern as you would think. Now, when you're talking about a foam mattress, foam on each side, yep. you're not as aware of the crack actually, because it kind of gives with you. Now, if we're looking at an inner spring mattress where they've reinforced the edges, how they're made today, you're gonna be very aware. Yeah, you showed me that when we were talking. When you sit on, it, it, it's just more, I guess, pronounced, right? Yes. That's the difference yes. there. So the, the split may not feel as good on an inner spring as it could on a, on a foam mattress. Gotcha. All right, we're gonna be delicate with our language here, but how does snugglers, we'll say, partners fare with that split king? That's a great question. It's one we get a lot, a lot. So um, the weird thing is, is when people sleep on a queen mattress, everybody kind of sleeps in the middle of that mattress. I don't know why. You take those same two people and put them on a king size bed, they do tend to stay on their side of the bed on a king. Don't know why, but it's the truth. Hmm. But if you are a middle of the bed snuggler all night, um, you're gonna be aware of this. So if you absolutely want a, an adjust, a split king mattress adjustable, let's look at maybe a foam where you won't notice that as much. Got it, all right. So I know one other concern people have, we're on our each side here of the split king. I turn on my massage feature. Mm -hmm. Will my partner feel that as well or not? They should not. Most of the time they do not. They do hear it though, because it, it is a motor and they're much quieter today than they were in the past. But if you have a wood floor, believe me, they're gonna know that you've turned on their, your side of the adjustable base. All right, here's, I'm sure you get this question a lot. Sheets, can huh? I use one large king sheet to cover them both or not? Well, if you have a really, really deep pocket sheet that's really good and stretchy, maybe. Um, if you don't adjust your side much different, more different than your sleep partner. But most, in fact, do go into a split king sheet set, which is gonna be a twin long fitted here, a twin long fitted there, and then a top sheet. Do you need a deeper sheet to account for that movement or not? There's a lot of sheets that are designed for that, that you can kind of get those anywhere, but deeper pockets always gonna be recommended. Got it, okay, let's talk about making the bed. Is it a pain? to get in between there to try and change the sheets? Some say yes, a few say no. I personally don't think it's that big of a deal because I raise the head and feet and then pop the sheet on and then lay it flat and it kind of pulls out. But there is a little struggle if you have limited mobility to kind of get over on the inside of that crack and get it tucked in there. Got it, something to consider uh, there with that. I think another question I think I have as well, will these two split king uh, mattresses fit inside my bed, talking headboard and footboard. Absolutely, absolutely. So um, if you have a headboard, footboard, and side rails, what happens is your delivery team will come in and remove maybe some crossbar slats. If they're not in the way, that's fine, they can stay. And then the adjustable bases have their own legs. So they literally stand up inside of the bed and furniture you have now. So any kind of standard, true king, cow king, queen, full, twin, twin long, any of that will work. Let's talk about the positives here as, as we go through. We've talked about issues. When I, I think the biggest selling point for many has got to be, it can be a personal experience, right. right? It's like, we're looking at here. If I want to sit up a little bit, my partner wants to lay flat, great, vice versa. Absolutely, right. that, that's a biggie. 
One person has back issues, so their feet need to be in the air. One pe person has digestive issues, so their head needs to be up. So you have that individual preference in the position you sleep in. Even more so, you like a soft mattress and your sleep partner likes a firm, done. You just buy the firm mattress. It can even get even dicier. If you like a firm all foam mattress and your sleep partner likes an inner spring with a pillow top that's super soft and squishy and they mush down right on in there, that'll work too. You can do whatever you want on your side. So it really is a sleep system and you can make it your own. Got it. And the same with the massage feature, right? Yes. You can have it or not. You can do one base without it and one base with. Probably better to do two because once they see you enjoying your massage feature on your base, they're gonna want it too. Got it. One other real pro here with, with this and something you hope you don't have to deal with is, let's say somebody has knee surgery and they can't make it up the stairs. You can literally take that mattress, move it to another part of the house, yeah, right? Yeah, take that adjustable base and that mattress and move it downstairs while we recover. That's a big plus. I mean, in years to come, a lot of times we keep those adjustable bases throughout the years and then change in the mattress, you know, the top of it. But yeah, you can split them if need to be. Well, great job by Victoria there, dealing with all of our potential concerns if we go with the Split King mattress. One other thing for you to do, go to our YouTube channel and you can watch a video about another issue concerning your sleep system and that's what base to go with. Adjustable base versus flat mattress foundation. Check out that video as well. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.